USB Type-C offers higher power to go with faster data rates and a reversible plug. To understand how USB-C enables fast charging of power-hungry portable devices, it's important to understand how the USB base standard, the power delivery standard, and the Type-C connector specification work together. The USB base standard provides the foundation for the USB interface with data rates up to 20 gigabits per second. Power delivery is one of USB's supplementary standards, and the latest power delivery standard, PD 3.0, enables power levels up to 100 watts. Unlike the legacy 4 or 5 pin USB connectors, USB Type-C uses the same connector for both ends of the cable. It has 24 pins arranged symmetrically to make the connector reversible and enable all the features of USB 3.2 and PD 3.0. Four V-Bus and four ground pins are used for power transfer. By default, USB-C can deliver 5 volts at 3 amps, or 15 watts. With USB PD 3.0, the source and sync negotiate a power contract up to 100 watts, with voltages from 5 to 20 volts, and current up to 5 amps. This negotiation happens using the configuration channel, or CC pin. USB receptacles have two CC pins, while the USB-C cable only has one CC pin. Depending on the cable orientation, the single CC pin in the cable is connected to either CC1 or CC2 on the receptacle, and thus allows the receptacle to determine the cable orientation. D plus and D minus are used to support the legacy USB 2.0 battery charging specification, BC 1.2, and allows for legacy power sources to be used with a USB-C cable. Maxim Integrated's USB-C portfolio enables designers to easily implement USB-C and benefit from its power capabilities. Power-efficient chargers and converters reduce bomb costs and solution size, while USB-C and PD controllers enable simple, robust, and flexible designs. Designers can also leverage our power path and protection ICs that integrate the highest levels of protection to reliably protect products with a single chip.